I'd like to thank the gift of art for starting me on a pastime that has really brought a lot of pleasure to my life when things have been pretty hard. It's gotten me through a lot of hours in both the hospital and at home when I found something that I could do and it was different from just obsessively Googling as I have a, a hankering to do at times. I started coloring because I was waiting to get discharged from the hospital and that's a process that takes hours. Even if they tell you it's going to be in one hour, that translates three more hours. Somebody dropped off a coloring book and a box of crayons while I was in the bathroom and I came out and, oh, look at this. And I opened a book and looked through and said, oh, this owl isn't very complicated. I can do that. And I sat down and started coloring. And I'm not a color in the lines kind of person. And I had one drawing class in college and it was uh, one of the techniques was to draw lines in, reminiscent of uh, Vincent van Gogh and it was definitely a color outside the line so this simple owl f fit that really well so and the the nurses and the techs they were watching and was like wow that's pretty cool because I used a lot of colors from the, the crayon box to give the night sky uh, a depth and a, a reflection. That When you look at the sky, it's not a solid color. It's lots of colors and the night sky changes depending on the season, the time of day, the clouds. It's just a simple thing. And I took home the coloring book in the box of crayons and the next thing that I did was this simple drum. And I was like, yeah, I love mixing the colors and just love combining the color to make new colors on the page. And then I did a sunflower. And I wasn't really sure what a sunflower with a face should look like. So I looked on Google to see, well, what would a sunflower <laughs> look like? And was inspired to use the peaches and the yellows and the, hmm, how do I make the leaves different textures and stuff and how do I make the background and the medium was just so fun to experiment with and I just the pictures were big and I didn't care if I colored outside the lines with this technique that who cares it's coloring what am I what there's nothing really to go wrong here